Hey, Mr. Steve, how's it going? We have about half an hour, which is awesome because I want to go and uh, take a crack at the at at least one of the materials of this person here. It's an Alexia. This was a, a head scan I took from 3DSK and bolted onto the Genesis character. And this is what we've made all, at the weekend in the Das Plus stream. And I said I was going to go and uh, render it out. Currently, her shirt kind of matches the hair and that's the default material that was on there but i'm trying to get this i'm trying to get something uh, prettier onto it in das studio so we'll see how that works i might try a shader that i have see how that goes do we have another one it's the second one i want to do is i think this guy here i don't think i have him rendered out but I've done some work on this uh, portrait here, the Matthew Pirate. So that's another um, thing. <laughs> Let's see if we can do it. I'm not going to save this. I'm going to go and see if that's still available. Tonya. Alexia. Alexia PFP. That's it. Steve, congrats on moving into your own home. That is really, really cool. Steve has been living out of hotels and from, you know, back rooms with his son and all that. I'm so glad you have your proper home again and that you can start getting your 3D career back on its feet, which, you know, it hasn't been for a while. So I'm, I, I'm just I'm just imagining that you must be itching to get back into it. So I'm, I'm just so glad that you're back. <laughs> ah, the COVID booster. Dang, brother. That is cold. The COVID booster. I'll take the hair away and have a look. She's, she's decent, isn't she? Yeah, she's kind of decent. So let's take a look at the shirt. Strappy top. This is from 3D Universe, I believe, and it didn't come with materials. It just had this one material on it. I believe I'm going to go and, uh, and check this out. It is part of... It's called Clothing Set 01, I believe. And I keep missing it. There it is. It's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. That's it. Defaults Clothing. This is it. So in shaders, we have various things we can try out. Let's go and select you. How many... We've got two material zones on here. Let's see if any of them work any better. These are kind of more silk shaders. It's not kind of what I had what I had hoped. Is this even the right set? It might not even be the, the right set. I might be in the wrong in the wrong section here. I might just go and and look for my own shaders collection here and see if there's any did i not install any shaders now i think maybe i haven't they were really nice black and white shaders have i not got them anymore <laughs> that ain't your pippy long stocking no is that what you call it pippy long strumper we used to call her pippy langstrumpf in germany <laughs> Weren't they just called black and white shift monochrome shaders? Yeah, there we go. Let me try those. I'll bring those in and I'll go and use this. There's also Fab Techs. I yeah, see some of these things are just not installed. Marble shaders we probably don't need. Yeah, that's good. Let's do that. Let's see what I can find in my shader library so I don't have to go into Substance Painter because we only have 20 minutes. Chris is streaming after me at 7 p.m. Hang around for that. Oh, Pippa Lotta, Victualia, Rulgardina, Cruz Münter. Oh, wow. Ephraim's daughter, Langstrom. Wow, that is, that's quite, you, do you remember that? Crazy stuff. Camilla, tell me about last names in Sweden. Can I tell, and I'm, I'm assuming that's how it works, because in the rest of the Western world, I can tell by the last names if people are related. Is that the same in Sweden? If somebody's called, I don't know, probably not Smith, but if 
if you if you'd imagine Smith being your last name, would you would your um, would your kids be also called uh, Drakenborg, for example? Oh, you don't know where Photoshop is. That's a good point. Uh, didn't I tell you? Good point. Thank you, install manager. I'm asking because in Iceland it's so fascinating that you can't tell. So if you have a, if you have a son, oh, okay. Yeah, okay, good, good. So so your kids have the same last name as you do. Right, right. Your son is Drakenborg also. Okay, good stuff. Because in Iceland that's not the case and it's just that's really rattling. So if you have I remember working with a director called Ari Arison and all we could tell is that his dad's name was Ari, but Arison wouldn't so his his son wouldn't necessarily be called well in his case he would be but so so it kind of works by whatever first name and then whatever your father's first name was and then it's son or daughter depending on that's just kind of a crazy way of naming people because what's what's the phone book look like <laughs> it's crazy isn't it Ulfried's daughter right right cool I like it <laughs> good name isn't it and Hjotter and says, good names, I have to say. We just watched um, Trapped. That was Icelandic and it wasn't overdubbed. It was with English subtitles. I loved it. Very good. So, third eye shop is here. That's where it is. There. Reattempt install. Yes, please do that. Goody. So, shaders. There's the monochrome shaders that I've been thinking about. So let's see if we can work that on her here. I don't know what they're gonna look like. Uh, is that gonna be is that gonna be good? Are they gonna be a bit hypnotic? With spots? Uh, maybe maybe we're already getting somewhere. That's not bad, especially also with the with the straps here. Dude, this might be nice. I, I'm in for something. That's perfect! Kind of matches her facial expression, this. <laughs> that, not so much. That's also neat. No, I think, I think this here, that was just, that was just perfect for her facial expression. Pippi's Ephraim's daughter is the Swedish version of the Icelandic last name. Check it out. That is crazy good. How, what are we doing about the straps here? We should have something, something matching maybe. It might not, it might not work out that way. It might not work out as a, as a shader. Yeah, no, I think I'd like something more, uh, more plain for that. Yeah, man, that, that might work. If we make that smaller. Actually, yeah, that's almost, that's almost believably there, isn't it? I think maybe even smaller. Let's go, let's dig into the surface, into the trim under geometry. And go to the tiling and see if we make that uh, let's just like say call it 16 then that almost looks like a pattern here do you know i'm already happy let's go do this thing also give you your hair back i'm also not entirely happy about the uh, about the jewelry. I've just invested into some of Matty Manx's bits and pieces. <laughs> Matty's jewelry collection. Let's see. This seems to be the perfect time to put that into play. Jewelry excellence. Jewel excellence is called. Let's go install all this. Give a nice kind of, you know, better bracelet than the one that she has right now. Maybe something more pronounced. All right. Jeweled Excellence. This is actually Sloshworks hair shader. I think the default hair shader didn't speak to me as well as the Sloshworks. So that was that was neat to know. This might be a little too uh, 
too bright. I'm going to turn this down a bit. PC necklace. I'll just make it invisible for now so that we can... Let's give us some earrings and a necklace of some description. Let's see where Matty is hidden at. Could be accessories. Yes! Okay, cool. There's bracelets. Let's, let's try this here. Earrings. Maybe something black, like this here. Will that work? Black and dangly, come on, are we in position? Still thinking about it or not? No. Let's move them where they need to be. Oops. Maybe the parameter dials are, are more suited to this. Which way around should they be? And there we go. Okay, earring one fixed. Earring number two, we might not even see, but there we go, that's that's that. Goody. See if we can give you a necklace. And that might be... Oh, it's different shaders as well. Yes, 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 yes. I like it. I like it. I like it. I need some decent 3D jewelry, you know. Uh, we don't see her arms, so we don't need the bracelets. Even though that is really good to know that there's so much variety in this pack. Yes, very nice. How about a necklace? Do we have one? Those are rings. Those are shaders for the jewelry. Also good. Okay, cool. We'll stick with the KC necklace then, I'm thinking. I mean, we can always have a look for for other things in my, in my accessory stock. The Claudi necklace, also a possibility. Let's try that out. That's a little more pronounced. I might actually go with that instead of the one that I had, which was this one. Yeah, let's do that one. That interferes less with the with the color. Okay, good, perfect. I like it. Finish one promo. Goody. Do we need anything else? Other accessories I can think of. We're leaving it like that. Partly I want to sh show off the head and the body shape because that's kind of what we've what we've made on the weekend. So I'll go and save that out. And then it's nearly time to go over to Mr. Chris. Alexia PFP2 or V2. I'll go and render this out once we're on the air with Mr. Chris.